Hello everyone, and welcome to DeepWord API. This tutorial will be on DeepWord, a Python library that can be used to create synthetic videos of people talking using our API, just like this one. We said, all right, well, let's just say the oxygen takes those two electrons, then each of those hydrogens will lose an electron. And have a While you can create these videos on our website, deepword.co, if you require scaled video production for individual customers, employees, or sales prospects, either within or outside your own native applications, you can use this Python package to do just that. We've kept DeepWord API simple so that people with little to no programming experience can use it as well. This video is just a walkthrough of the functionalities provided in DWORD, so if you prefer written instructions, feel free to refer to our documentation. The first step is to create an account on DeepWord. To do so, go to login.deepword.co and click on Start Creating in the top right. Next, you'll need to purchase video credits to be able to use the API. To give some context, each video credit is equal to 20 seconds of generated video, but of course discounts are applied the more credits are purchased at one time. We recommend testing your own video actors on our website before generating multiple videos of them with our API, just to make sure that you are satisfied with the generated results. However, we do have an API tutorial on quickly testing audios across a multitude of different video actors to see which ones give the best results. So definitely check out that tutorial if you'd like to quickly test multiple video actors before widespread use, all natively within our API. To get your API and secret keys, click on the API tab on the left. Click Generate API Token, and then copy them for later. We can paste the API key and secret key in a separate Python file called config.py so that we don't accidentally push it to GitHub. We'll start by installing the DWORD library. We can do just that with pip install DWORD. Next, we need to make sure that we have FFmpeg installed. FFmpeg, or FFmpeg, is the leading multimedia framework for audio and video conversions and processing. Now, we can log into our DeepWord account via the API. Here, we will import the API key and secret key and log in as follows. We will start by making sure that we have enough video credits to create our synthetic video. Remember, we need one credit for every 20 seconds of video. Here, we have 32 credits available, so we can move forward. Next, we need a video of the person talking and the audio we want them to say. I already have a video and audio in my current directory for this tutorial. For best results, make sure that the video is of a single, well-lit individual. No other faces should be in frame. They should be directly facing the camera. What they're saying is irrelevant, but they don't have to be speaking. They shouldn't be too close nor too far away. Five to ten feet away from the camera is optimal. They should be stationary, either seated or standing and not moving too excessively. They should be making minimal expressions with an open mouth, so your footage shouldn't really include any large smiles, yawning, laughing, etc. Finally, there shouldn't be any obstructions to their nose, lips, or jaw. Even a single rogue frame can produce poor results. As per your audio, if you aren't using our neural text-to-speech, just make sure it's of a single individual, that audio levels aren't clipping, that there is minimal background feedback, and that they are clearly pronouncing the words they are speaking. The video you are watching is 100%. Once we have our inputs, we can generate our synthetic video. Here, we can use account.generateVideo and provide your inputs. You can also optionally provide a title for your output video. This takes some time to generate, and will also reflect in your DeepWord account. However, you can list all the videos on your DeepWord account using account.list videos. Here, we have five videos in our account. We can see the metadata for each video, including its duration, date created, status, and so on. We can either download this video using its video ID once it is finished processing, or we can download all videos on our account using account.download all videos. You can also provide a folder name to download all videos where you want your videos downloaded. If you've been following along with us step by step, congratulations. You just created your first DeepWord video with DeepWord API. The video you are watching is 100% fake. That's right. I'm not actually speaking any of the words that are coming out of my mouth. In fact, you can create... While we only created one video in this tutorial, 
DeepWord API can be used to create and personalize thousands of videos for your own uses at scale. Check out some of our other tutorials to learn how we can create video templates for data filled CSV files, or how you can apply DeepWord API to your own native applications with your own users, customers, or employees. We also have more tutorials on other important DeepWord core and utility functionalities. DeepWord, video production minus the camera.